Okay, this is going to be system test 11. So I took the MS5ED down, and this is probably going to be going out to wheel lock alarms sometime soon. And I got the new uh, Silent Night system up and running, and here it is. As you can see, I've made a few little changes to the system. I installed this, uh, this smoke detector enunciator up here, and I also got a uh, Silent Night addressable monitor module. So now the panel can read this pole station as an addressable point rather than just a uh, conventional zone. And this, uh, this system sensor smoke detector is still just conventional. Um, since it's a two-wire smoke, I have to get a special module for it. And I also cleared all the troubles in the system. So you can see it says system is normal. And I usually have my address up there as the banner, but I took that down. I just replaced it with the default uh, for this video. So I have the, uh, the MS2 pull station. I have a uh, wheel lock 34T horn behind a Space Age light plate and a Gentex remote strobe. Uh, the system is going to be set on code 3 and the light plate is on pulse, so let's pull it. Silence it. Let's do an audible silence. Now let's reset the whole station. And I just have this enunciator uh, just flashing whenever an alarm comes in, it's on pulse. You can hear the relays clicking. And let's reset the system. And when it resets, I'll test the, uh, the smoke detector with a magnet. And so let me make sure the LED's on. Yep. So let's test it. There it goes. And it's going to reset, and for some reason with these smoke detectors it takes a long time to reset. My camera's almost out of batteries, so I'm just going to go ahead and stop it right here. So thanks for watching.